Hello dear friends, welcome to ACAD Designing. This is the SOLIDWORKS 3D Modeling, Exercise Number 9. We make this 3D model, with the help of this diagram, in minimum and simple steps. Let's start. Launch your SOLIDWORKS software. Click on New. Select the part. And then OK. We will make a 3D model help of this diagram. You can check the link of this diagram in the description for your practice. First, we analyze the diagram and decide the steps. At the start, we select the front plane for the sketch and draw the center rectangle, 30 mm by 45 mm. Then we use the chamfer tool for this corner and extrude this sketch for 60 mm. Next, we select the top face of the solid and draw a corner rectangle. 15 mm by 24 mm, and cut extrude this up to 10 mm. Then, once we select the same face for the sketch, and draw a square, 10 mm by 10 mm, and cut out this through from solid body, our 3D solid will be completed. Let's start modeling. Select the front plane and click on the sketch. Select the Center Rectangle tool from the Sketch tab. The Select Origin Point for the center point of the rectangle. Move the cursor away. Put the 30 mm width of the rectangle. Press Enter. Put the 45 mm length of the rectangle. Press Enter. And escape the command. Go to the Sketch tab. Drop down the Sketch Fillet option and select the Sketch Chamfer tool. Put the value 12 mm as shown in the diagram. Make sure we select a distance distance option, as well as checked equal distance options. Now select this corner point of the rectangle and see magic. This corner chamfered at 12 mm of the corner. Click on mark OK. Our sketch is done. Go to the Feature tab and select the Extruded Boss Base tool. Switch the extrude direction from here. Like this. Put the 60 mm extrude value. And click on Mark OK. Now next step. Select this face and select the sketch. Now here we draw a corner rectangle, 15 mm by 24 mm. Go to the Sketch tab. Drop down the Rectangle options and select a corner rectangle. Select this corner point for the first point of the rectangle. Move the cursor in this direction. Put the 24 mm length of the rectangle and press Enter. Put the value 15 mm width of the rectangle. Press Enter. Escape the command. Now, need to cut out this profile. Go to the Feature tab and select the Extruded Cut tool. Put the value here. 10 mm. See the preview. Click on Mark OK. Our sketch is cut out from this solid object. Now next, we have to cut out this square block from this solid. Select this face again and select a sketch. Go to the Sketch tab and once select the corner of the rectangle. Select this corner point for the first point of the square. Move the cursor in this direction. Put the 10 mm value first side of the square and press Enter. Put the value 10 mm second side of the square and press Enter. Escape the command. Go to the Feature tab and once select the Extruded Cut tool. See the direction of the extruded cut. You can select and drag this arrow for extruded cut how much you want to. Also, you can drop down the direction 1 option and select through all option. See the preview, this option it will extrude cuts perfectly through the entire solid object. Click on mark OK. Our 3D model is completed. Let me choose some material for this object. Go to appearance. Drop down the appearance and select metal. Select copper material and I choose cast copper material. 
Just drag it on the object and select the body option. Now, here we applied material on this 3D object. You can choose any other material as you like or as per your requirement. I hope all the steps you have understood. If you do not understand any of the steps, then comment to me. As soon as possible I will answer you. If you like this video then hit the like button, share this video, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching this video. See you in the next exercise tutorial. Have a nice day.